In this Canva tutorial, I'm going to show you how to show rulers in Canva so you can create precise designs and have a more enjoyable design experience when you're creating designs and products. To do this, you'll open a design or start a new design. Then you'll go up to File, click on File. You'll go down to View Settings. Once you're on View Settings, another pop-up will come out and it'll say Show Rulers and Guides. You can click on Show Rulers and Guides here. You also have a shortcut that they show you that you can use on your keyboard as well. So you click on that and you'll see that at the top you have a ruler now and at the side you have a ruler. So this is fantastic because you can actually click on this, click on the ruler at the top and drag it down. Then you can drop it at anywhere on the side. You can do the same thing on the other side. You can drag it over. You can make yourself a little grid if you want to design within a certain frame. So you have a lot of options for dragging rulers and kind of creating a frame for yourself for your design. Another way you can add the individual guides is to right click on your design and scroll down to where it says guides. Over here, a pop-up will show up and it will say add horizontal guide. You can do that, add a vertical guide, clear guides to get rid of all of them, or lock guides to keep them all in place. So if you click add horizontal guide, it'll add that right there. Then you can right click again and do the same thing with a vertical guide. It does it basically right where you click. So if you right click somewhere and you add a vertical guide, it'll do it right where you clicked. So that's another way to do it. And this can be really helpful if you're wanting to do something precise. So if you're scrolling in, if you zoom, 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 zoom in, you can drag these to like very precise measurements. So you can just drag and drop to the like very small amounts if you are going to create designs. So let's say you have those rulers on your page. So you can add something to the page and then use those rulers to kind of guide you on how big you want it to be and very quickly and easily use the rulers to create the size design that you want no matter what shape it is. If you want to remove them from your design, you just hover over it, click, and then drag it off the page. So you can do that as many times as you need. You just hover over it, it'll select, you click it, and you drag it off the design. And then that will get rid of it, and you can remove as many as you want. And then if you want to clear all of the guides, you right click on your design and scroll down to where it says guides. Over here, a pop-up will show up, and then if you want to clear all of the guides using this method, you just click that and they're all gone. If you're unhappy with anything you've done, including clearing the guides, you can always Command or Control Z or go up here to undo and it will just undo what you've done. And then the final thing is to lock the guides where you click lock guides and then you cannot move them. So if you want to unlock your guides, you just right click, go to guides, and then go down to unlock guides, and then you can move everything. Rulers can be incredibly helpful when you're designing products or any sort of design. I hope this tutorial on how to show rulers in Canva was helpful.